For the past two weeks, the FAA has been testing drone detection technology over the water near Cape May, New Jersey. As drone use becomes a normal part of aviation, we want to more accurately detect drones in our nation's airspace. And we want to make sure these drones don't interfere with aircraft navigation systems. I think drones are becoming more ubiquitous wherever you go. You hear more about drones all the time, and so we have to make sure that the airspace is safe not just for the drones, but for the other aircraft. And being an operator of airports, that's very, very important to us. The FAA receives more than 100 drone sighting reports near airports each month, which is why we want to send a clear message that operating drones around airplanes, helicopters, and airports is dangerous and illegal. Led by the FAA's Center for Excellence for UAS Research, we tested more than 100 commercial, home-built, and off-the-shelf drones of various sizes and at different speeds and altitudes. The results were eye-opening, and I'm happy to report that detection technology helped us identify drones immediately. This work will help us continue to enhance safety throughout the national airspace system and identify those legally operating and illegally operating. The more we discover the significance of the testing that happens here specifically today, we realize that it's a starting point of a lot of different testing, but if it starts here, we know that it'll eventually benefit not only the region and the nation, but potentially the international community as well.